have any other questions for me, Counselor. Lieutenant Cathy. <laughs> Lieutenant, do you have anything further for this witness? Thanks, Danny. I love Washington. Excuse me. I didn't dismiss you. I beg your pardon? I'm not through with my examination. Sit down. Colonel. What's that? I'd appreciate if he would dress me as Colonel or Sir. I believe I've earned it. Defense counsel will address the witness as Colonel or Sir. I don't know what the hell kind of unit you're running here. And the witness will address this court as judge or your honor. I'm quite certain I've earned it. Take your seat, Colonel. Welcome, mean? everyone. King here, back with another video. So today, we're going to talk about the importance of choosing the right attorney. Whether you are dealing with a complex legal issue or simply needing a, an advice, having the right legal representation can significantly impact the outcome of your case. So let's explore the top reasons why. Before we begin, I'm not a lawyer, nor do I play one on TV. First and foremost, expertise and specialization. Attorneys have different areas of expertise, just like doctors. So hiring a lawyer who specializes in your specific legal matter ensures that you have someone with the necessary knowledge and expertise to handle your case effectively. Here is a few of the legal areas of expertise. Criminal defense, family law, divorce, wrongful death, injury claims, DUIs, real estate, probate, and other civil matters, just like air property law. What do you want to discuss now? My favorite color? Colonel, the 6 a.m. flight was the first one off the base? Yes. There wasn't a flight that left seven hours earlier and landed at Andrews Air Force Base at 2 a.m.? Lieutenant, I think we've covered this, haven't we? Your Honor, these are the Tower Chief's logs from both Guantanamo Bay and Andrews Air Force Base. Guantanamo log lists no flight that left at 11 p.m. and the Andrews log lists no flight that landed at 2 a.m. I'd like to admit them as defense exhibits Alpha and Bravo. I don't understand. You're admitting evidence of a flight that never existed. Oh, we believe it did, sir. Defense will be calling Airman Cecil O'Malley and Airman Anthony Rodriguez. They were working the ground crew at Andrews at 2 a.m. on the 7th. Your Honor, these men weren't on the list. Rebuttal witnesses, Your Honor, are called specifically to refute testimony offered under direct examination. I'll allow the witnesses. This is ridiculous. Colonel, a moment ago, check the tower logs for Christ's sake. The second reason for choosing a lawyer comes down to knowledge of legal procedures. The legal system can be complex and overwhelming. And a skilled attorney understands the ins and outs of legal procedures, such as following documents, meeting deadlines, and navigating the courtroom. It will guide you through the process, ensuring you don't miss any crucial steps. Following of documents can make or break a case, so it's important that the document or documents being filed are formatted correctly. The information is accurate and is filled in in a timely manner. Otherwise, the document may be not permitted as evidence or the case may be dismissed based on the proper filing. So meeting deadlines are crucial to a case. It is important for attorneys to pay attention to the deadlines to ensure the proper representation for the clients. Missed court hearings and deadlines can cause the case to be dismissed or even further delayed. Well, we'll get to the airman in just a minute, sir. A moment ago, you said that you ordered Lieutenant Kendrick to tell his men that Santiago wasn't to be touched. That's right. And Lieutenant Kendrick was clear on what you wanted? Crystal. Any chance Lieutenant Kendrick ignored the order? Ignored the order? Any chance he forgot about it? No. Any chance Lieutenant Kendrick left your office and said, the old man is wrong? No. When Lieutenant Kendrick spoke to the platoon and ordered them not to touch Santiago, any chance they ignored him? You ever served in an infantry unit, son? No, sir. Ever served in a forward area? No, sir. 
Ever put your life in another man's hands? Asked him to put his life in yours? No, sir. We follow orders, son. The third reason is objective advice. When you are personally involved in a legal matter, emotions can cloud your judgment. A good attorney provides objective advice and can analyze the situation from a legal standpoint, as well as offer guidance based on your experience. This means you can make well-informed decisions without being driven solely by emotions. In my opinion, an attorney provides an objective look at the case it means that the attorney cares about clients and the case and not just about being paid for their services. One thing you do not need is to have an attorney who is not providing a truthful objective about the case but finds it necessary to charge a fee for everything under the sun but fails to communicate effectively and appropriately. To include an attorney not providing time and communication in regards to answering clients' questions and or offering up the objective advice. We follow orders or people die. It's that simple. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Are we clear? Crystal. Colonel, I have just one more question before I call Airman O'Malley and Airman Rodriguez. If you gave an order that Santiago wasn't to be touched. And your orders are always followed. And why would Santiago be in danger? Why would it be necessary to transfer him off the base? Santiago was a substandard Marine. He was being transferred. That's not what you said. You said he was being transferred because he was in grave danger. That's correct. You said he was in danger. I said grave danger. You said is there I any recall other... what I said. I can have the court reporter read back to you. I right? know what I said. I don't have to have it read back to me like I'm. Why the two orders? orders, Colonel? Sometimes men take matters into their own hands. No, sir, you made it clear just a moment ago that your men never take matters in their own hands. Your men follow orders or people die. So Santiago shouldn't have been in any danger at all, should he have, Colonel? You snotty little bastard. Your Honor, I'd like to ask for a recess. I'd like an answer to the question, Judge. The court will wait for an answer. Next up, coming at number four, building strong legal strategies. A skilled attorney knows how to develop a solid legal strategy tailored to your case. They will analyze the evidence, research precedents, and identify the best course of action. By constructing a robust strategy, they will enhance your chances of achieving a favorable outcome. If Lieutenant Kendrick gave an order that Santiago wasn't to be touched, then why did he have to be transferred? Colonel, Lieutenant Kendrick ordered the code red, didn't he? Because that's what you told Lieutenant Kendrick to do. Object! When it went bad, you cut friends. these guys loose! Your Honor, you had markers inside the phony transfer! Your Honor, you doctored the logbook! Damn it, Captain! You coerced the doctor! Consider yourself in contempt! You. Colonel Jessup, did you order the code red? You don't have to answer that question. I'll answer the question. You, you want, want answers? I think I'm entitled. You want answers! I want the truth! You can't handle the truth! Son, we live in a world that has walls, and those walls have to be guarded by men with guns. Who's going to do it? You? You, Lieutenant Weinberg? I have a greater responsibility than you can possibly fathom. You weep for Santiago, and you curse the Marines. You have that luxury. You have the luxury of not knowing what I know, that Santiago's death, while tragic, probably saved lives. And my existence, while grotesque and incomprehensible to you, saves lives. You don't want the truth because deep down in places you don't talk about at parties. You want me on that wall. You need me on that wall. We... Our fifth and final reasons are effective negotiation and advocacy skills. Many legal matters can be resolved through negotiation, avoiding lengthy courtroom battles. A competent attorney possesses excellent negotiation skills to be advocating for your clients and interests. The case proceeds to trial. Their advocacy skills shine in the courtroom, presenting your case persuasively. Effective negotiation and advocacy skills are both important, especially if it leads to the case being resolved before going to trial, but more so, the attorney should be competent and skilled in their ability to perform well during trial. So this goes back to choosing the right attorney by doing research and asking the right questions during consultations, meetings, and in any form of correspondence and communication. 
We use words like honor, code, loyalty. We use these words as the backbone of a life spent defending something. You use them as a punchline. I have neither the time nor the inclination to explain myself to a man who rises and sleeps under the blanket of the very freedom that I provide and then questions the manner in which I provide it. I would rather you just said thank you and went on your way. Otherwise, I suggest you pick up a weapon and stand a post. Either way, I don't give a damn what you think you are entitled to. Did you order the code red? I did the job. Did you order the code red? You're goddamn right I did. Please, the court, I suggest the members be dismissed so that we can move to an immediate Article 39A session. The witness has rights. Captain Ross. Jack. These were just a few of the top reasons why choosing the right lawyer is crucial. From their expertise and knowledge of legal procedures, to effective advice, strong legal strategies, and effective negotiation skills, a skilled attorney can be your best ally. Remember, when it comes to legal matters, do not underestimate the importance of finding the right attorney. Take your time, do your research, and choose wisely. Especially choose wisely when it comes to the cost. Legal representation fees, court costs, and other fees associated with legal case can vary but it can be a quite costly mistake if you do not choose the right attorney. So always ask up front about the cost and other fees could be applied to the case. I thank you for watching. I'll see you in another video. Take care. Peace.